coming up on this week's episode of Go With The Heat. Crockett's girlfriend threatens his case and his career in the episode, Teresa. On this week in Vice, we'll be covering when this episode of Miami Vice aired from February 9th to February 15th, 1987, when Miami Vice was king. In news, on February 15th, the television show America premiered on ABC. Starring Chris Christopherson, Sam Neill, Robert Urich, and Lara Flynn Boyle, the story is about life in the United States after a takeover by the Soviet Union. The series was 14 and a half hours long, with TV Guide calling America the most boring miniseries in a decade. In music, pushing Madonna aside and triumphantly returning to the top of the Billboard Hot 100 is the triple platinum Bon Jovi classic, Living on a Prayer. Often considered the greatest song of the 80s, anytime this song is played, strangers unite arm in arm and joyously sing together. The whole world rooted for Tommy and Gina. Just hold on to what you got and give it a shot. In movies, Platoon still holds the box office for one more week, so we gotta go to the archives. I could talk about the romantic comedy Mannequin starring Andrew McCarthy and Kim Cattrall, but it's not very good to enforce me to acknowledge Starship and their Oscar-nominated song. Instead, I'd rather talk about a much better film and the greatest arm wrestling movie ever in Over the Top. Starring Sylvester Stallone as Lincoln Hawk, he treks to Las Vegas to compete in the World Arm Wrestling Championship to win back the love of his son and get a new long-haul big rig. This is the exact type of movie that makes the 80s the best decade what i do is i i just try to take my hat and i turn it around and it's like a switch that goes on and that's everything you need to know that was happening when miami vice was king be sure to join us on go with the heat at go with the i'd love to hear from you email the show go with the heat at gmail.com or follow me on twitter at dom corvo that's all for this week bye pals